Good day, everybody. How are you all? This is Dr. Nandi. Today we are going to talk about uh, frequency distribution. So I'll share my computer screen with you. The speeds of 21 airplanes are shown in miles per hour. So there are different classes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight classes of groups of speeds, air speeds, and then the corresponding frequency. Part A, what percent of the planes has speeds less than or equal to 428? Part B, what percent of the planes has speeds equal to or greater than 429? And part C, what percent of the planes has speeds between 471 and 533? So, I'll get started by creating some space for myself. So, okay. The colors. So, first we will do the relative frequency. Relative frequency of each class relative frequency. The first one is 4 over 21, which is equal to, get my calculator, is 4 divided by 21. And in all this, I'll keep it to two places of decimal. So 4 divided by 21 is 0 0.19. Next one is 2 divided by 21 is equal to 0.19. Maybe I have to go to 3 pluses of decimal because this is 0 0.095. Okay. And then 3 divided by 21. And that is equal to 0 0.143. The next one is again 0 0.095. Next one will be 1 divided by 21, which is half of 0 0.095. So it is 0. Point, uh, you might say 0. Point 0.048. Next one is 0 0.095. Next one is 3 divided by 21. We have already done that. 0 0.143. And the last is 0 0.19. So if I add all the relative frequencies, let me see what do I get. 0.19 plus 0 0.095 plus 0.143 plus 0 0.095, plus 0 0.048, plus 0 0.095, plus 0.143, plus 0.19. And the total is equal to, as I told you, it would be close to 1, but not exactly 1, which can be actually rounded to 1, which is almost equal to, this symbol means almost equal to 1.0 as you would expect, okay? So let's answer the questions now. Part A, what percent of the planes has speeds equal, less than or equal to 428? That means the first three classes, 366 to 386, 387 through 407, and 408 to 428. So we add the three. 0 0.19 plus 0 0.095 plus 0 0.143. Okay, and that is equal to, so let me, okay, sorry about this, this one will be less than, Uh, maybe it's less than uh, 
less than then we should do this one. This. So it is equal to this is equal to at the first three relative frequency 0 0.19 plus 0 0.095 plus 0 0.143 and that is equal to 0 0.428. So 42.8 percent of the planes have speeds equal to a less than 48. Now, I forgot to create another column here, which you can always do as the cumulative relative frequency. Relative frequency. So basically, we were start with first class. There is no frequency on top of it. So the cumulative relative frequency is 0 0.19. The next one will be 0 0.19 plus because 0 0.19 frequency is on top of 0 0.095 for this class, and that is equal to uh, 0 0.19 plus 0 0.095 is equal to 0 0.285. The next one will be uh, 0 0.28 on top of it plus 0 0.143. And that is equal to 0.28 plus 0.143 is equal to 0.285 oh, plus 0.13 is equal to 0.415. Where did I get? Uh, 0 0.19 plus 0 0.19 plus 0 0.095 is 0.285. This should be a 0 0.285. So this will be a 0 0.285 plus 0 0.1 plus 0 0.143 is equal to 0 0.428. 0 0.428 as we obtained in part one. Next one will be 0 0.428 on top of it plus 0 0.095. And that is equal to 0 0.428 plus 0 0.095. And that is equal to 0 0.523. This is a zero. Zero point five two three. Next one will be zero point five two three plus zero point five two three plus zero point oh four eight. So this is a zero point. And that will be equal to point five two three plus Point five two three plus point zero four eight plus point zero four eight and that will be equal to point five seven one and the next one will be zero point five seven one on top of this class plus zero point oh nine five which will be equal to point five seven one plus point oh nine five. And that is equal to zero point zero point six six six. So this was zero point five seven one point six 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 plus so zero point six six six. The next one is six 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 plus zero point one four three, and that one is equal to plus point one four three is zero point. Eight zero nine zero point eight zero nine and the last cumulative frequency is zero point eight zero nine plus zero point one nine which is plus point one nine is equal to 
जीरो पॉइंट इज इक्वल टू जीरो पॉइंट नाइन 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 और क्लोज टू वन okay so this is the cumulative relative frequency we start with the first class relative frequency point 19 leave that as a cumulative relative frequency for class 1 then for the second class it's point 19 on top of point 09 so point 19 plus point 095 is point 285 and we continue in this fashion till we reach the last class where the sum of all the cumulative relative frequency is 1 okay part b what is uh, what percent of the planes has speeds equal to or greater than 429 equal to or greater than 429 means starting from fourth class fourth fifth sixth seventh and eighth class so we know up to uh, 428 it is 42.8% so percent of planes percent of planes with speeds equal to or greater than 429 is equal to we will use the complement rule over here equal to 100 which is the total percent minus percent which a uh, planes of speeds less than 429 and we have already determined that in part a so it is 100 minus 42.8 which is equal to 100 minus 42.8 is 57.2 57.2% okay now i will create some more space for myself to write okay and then we do part c part c says uh, between 471 and 533 which is the sum of the frequencies of the last three classes so that will be equal to 0.095 Plus zero point one four three, plus zero point one nine, and that is equal to point zero nine five, plus point one four three, plus point one nine, and that will be equal to zero point four two eight. Okay. Equal to forty-two point eight percent. So this is the percent of planes with speeds between four seventy-one and five thirty-three miles per hour. I'll stop here today. If you have any question, comment, write me a note. I'll reply to you as soon as possible. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. And uh, if you like this video, please let your friends know about it. Please subscribe to my channel. and please ask your friends to subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner of the screen thanks have a nice day take care see you next time when i come back with another interesting problem interesting solution